Good morning, workout buddies, and welcome to week seven, day two in our 12 week challenges. I'm coming at you Monday through Friday with health, fitness, and family videos. And if you need a workout buddy, hit the subscribe button and join us. Okay, let's do this. I'm ready. Uh huh. Let's do this. I'm ready to go. I'll never do that again. I'm sorry, guys. I feel like a doofus. I'm trying to come up with an intro that kind of explains what my videos are in case new people are coming in and they're like, what the heck is this chick talking about? Monday through Friday videos. I show you everything I eat. I show you my workout. And then there's quite a bit of tomfoolery in between. But that's me. Hello. We got on our cute workout gear and we are ready to hit the gym. First thing I do when I wake up is I put my gym clothes on. There's no time to even get motivated. You just do it, you just go, and then before you know it, your day has started and it's wonderful, it's glorious. Let's go. I've been doing a lot of traveling lately. We just got back in last night from our little Thanksgiving trip to Montana. Do you think your pee-pee's gonna freeze? No, I think it'll be fine. You've never looked more cool. Is this helping you? There's a truck. Hi, I'm Pia. <laughs> I have been sitting down a lot. I feel like I just need to kind of stretch out my body. So today we are doing my 30 minute stair climber workout. And if you guys want a follow along video, I have linked it in the description. It's just a 10 minute video and then you can repeat it two or three times depending on what level you guys are at. Right now I'm just procrastinating because it's cold outside. Three, two, one, go. Have you guys read the five second rule? I was listening to it on audiobook and she basically just says count down from five and then do what it is that you're procrastinating on. I like to use three seconds because five seconds I still got time to like talk myself out of it. Three seconds works better. All right, all the stair climbers are taken so I'm gonna warm up on the incline treadmill until something opens up. done. Feels so good. Homegirl has not been working on her splits training. I got a little distracted by the holiday and I only have like a month to be able to do the splits by the end of the year. So got a lot of work to do. My hamstrings are extra tight. So I'm going to roll them out today. And done. Let's go make some freaking French toast. I desperately need to go grocery shopping. I'm out of bananas, so there goes my smoothie or banana pancakes. So this morning, I'm just gonna have some cereal. Got this huge box of Quaker oatmeal squares at Costco. They're full of brown sugar and gluten, so I don't eat them very often. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add in some ground chia seeds, and I'm gonna add in some blueberries for some extra nutrients and for my omega fatty acids. This is also fortified with B12 and zinc and magnesium and iron, lots of good stuff. It's not all bad, but I'm gonna make sure to get a bunch of greens in later today. Easy peasy. Super easy way to bump up your cereal. We've got our omega-3s and extra antioxidants. And cereal by no means is unhealthy. However, some people are more sensitive to sugar and gluten, and I've noticed that I'm definitely more sensitive to both. I just notice I feel better when I have a green smoothie first thing in the morning. But you know, we are just traveling, and you just do the best that you can do. But we will go grocery shopping later, and I'll show you all the goods. We're all dressed and ready for the day. And let's not forget, we get a sticker on the calendar. Boom shakalaka. We got three more days, in November. Are you guys doing a workout calendar for December? I have to go get stickers or order stickers or something. But anyways, I wanna show you guys the outfit of the day. I'm wearing my favorite sweater ever. I think it's just a knit sweater. I love all the detailing in it. It's so pretty. We got a little braid going on there. And I've worn this sweater so much that the butt has stretched out. It used to be like a little higher, but I still love it. Just pairing it with some cute rolled up jeans and then some blue booties. So cute. I have a business meeting in a couple hours, so I'm going out for lunch today. I'll bring you guys with and show you what I get when I'm out and about. Right now I have some work to do, so I'm just gonna have a hot tea and sit down for a couple hours and get the stuff done. So, see you at lunchtime. Right now we are on our way to lunch and we are going to the place we always go to for lunch. What's it called? Thai Kitchen. Thai Kitchen. I'm gonna get some Thai food. Probably not gonna film too much because it's a business meeting after all, but I'll show you what I get. Alex's favorite place in the whole world. Yeah, Fred Meyer. 
Fred Meyer. He's doing a little shopping, but I know he hates being here, so we're gonna go. Can I just look at one more thing? It's organic cranberry splash for Alex. Oh. I bought all the bananas. I didn't know how much I love bananas till this morning, and we were out of them. And I was like, I can't make my smoothie or my pancakes. It's not cool, you guys, it's not cool. Just got home from lunch and I was right. I didn't film very much, but I wanted to show you what I had. I just ordered some white rice, some steamed veggies, and then they put their peanut sauce on the side and I also topped it off with sriracha. Pretty basic, but it's a great go-to whenever you go to any kind of like Asian dining place and you don't want to have any oil in your meal, you can just ask for steamed veggies. Or you can occasionally have oil in your meals. And I like to get soy sauce and sriracha on the side. Sometimes I'll ask for some lemon. But right now, I'm just having some celery. I like to get some fresh veggies. In, especially because I had cereal at breakfast. I'm gonna make sure I'm getting lots of fresh fruit and veg in for the rest of the day. Mmm, I actually like celery. That's pretty good. It is Ticino time, time for a little break. If you wanna order some, I just signed up to be an Amazon affiliate and there's links down below. If you so choose to support me and my channel, you can order them through my link. I'm gonna go in and put in my favorite flavors down there. The caramel nut is definitely number one. And I haven't had it since I ordered that little sampler packet. A lot of you have been asking where I get my booty bands and this barbell hip protector pad. All that stuff is linked there as well. So if you are looking into getting that, there's a link down in the description. Today I'm making some of the vanilla nut ticino. It's so good. And then I'm just pouring over some nut pods. This one is the French vanilla flavor. And in we go. For some reason the French vanilla had like little chunks in it, but it's a little better after I shook it up. The hazelnut one didn't have any chunks at all. Maybe it was just a bad batch. I don't know, still tastes good to me. There's nothing quite like a warm cup of coffee when it is freezing outside. Speaking of freezing outside, I finally bought a proper Winter jacket, it's so cute, I love it. I got it on a Black Friday sale at Kohl's. I pretty much stole this jacket from Kohl's. Crazy, it's so cute though, I love it. I've never been like a black jacket kind of girl, but I saw it online and I was like, yes, that is going on my body. So here we are. I also wanna go outside and take a walk just so I can wear my cute black jacket. It's time to go grocery shopping. I'm gonna do some meal prep tonight. I'm gonna make some potatoes, quinoa, brown rice. There was one other thing. I don't remember, but I hope it will come to me. So let's take a little trip to Costco. All right, home, and I'm gonna do some massive, massive meal prep. Every week I make a bunch of sweet potatoes. This week I'm gonna make some brown rice and combine it with cauliflower rice, just so I have that in my fridge. I'm also going to make some quinoa. I usually like to cook the veggies fresh, and I remembered the fourth thing that I was gonna meal prep, and that is my secret sauce, which you guys know I've showed in many videos, but this time instead of tahini, I'm gonna use almond butter, and instead of the dates, I'm gonna use maple syrup, because I know not a lot of you have a high speed blender, it's kinda hard to blend up those dates, so we're gonna use maple syrup is our sweetener, that way we can just kind of mix it all together. You don't even need a blender or nothing. Tonight, dinner's gonna be super simple. Gonna steam up some veggies and these little potatoes. Maybe make a veggie burger, put it over some greens, and then top it off with the sauce. Let's have an apple and get to cooking. Oh yeah, got an apple. to try. This is seriously one of my favorite meals. I love eating this way because most of my plate is full of veggies and that fills up your stomach, makes you feel satisfied. I used to eat a bodybuilding diet where it's basically just very sad chicken and broccoli and then an hour or two later I'd be freaking starving and so hangry. Getting in these greens and veggies really fills up your stomach, keeps you full for a while. We got in our protein today and the healthy carbs with the potatoes will also help me feel satiated for the rest of the night. I also put on some sauerkraut which may seem kind of of weird, but it has probiotics in it, so it's really good for digestion, and it adds a really yummy flavor. It reminds me kind of like a hot dog with sauerkraut on it. We got all sorts of good flavors going on here. Anyway, I want to try this new dressing, and sorry, I don't really measure. I really don't measure my dressings at all, but I'll give you an estimate so you can start somewhere. I would say four tablespoons of almond butter, two tablespoons of soy sauce, two tablespoons of chili garlic sauce, depending on how hot you like it. If you're not a spicy person, maybe just one, and then a lemon and two tablespoons of maple syrup. So everything is kind of equal parts 
parts except for the tahini or the almond butter that you're putting in. It's gonna be doubled. Hope that made sense. I'm working on an ebook right now, so I'm gonna have exact measurements for you guys soon. Oh my god. I even like it better with almond butter. I didn't think my secret sauce could get any better, but this, I think I like it better. So if you don't have a blender and you want to try the sauce, give it a whirl. I'm just sitting at the piano and practicing an old song. This is on my music channel if you guys want to check it out. It's called Wolves. I'll link it down below, but I haven't played it in forever, like over a year. So I'm just kind of practicing it. I'll play a little bit of it for you now. Yesterday she came around looking for something to kill. We're getting the music practice goals in. Whew, I just cleaned up my place and I'm about to sit down in front of my cute Christmas tree. I'm gonna light a candle and do some journal writing. Thank you guys for spending the day with me. I hope you enjoyed hanging out. I just want to say a huge thank you to you guys because you seriously keep me inspired. I get a lot of messages from you, especially on Instagram, being like, hey, I just ran a 7K, or I've lost five pounds this month. So this has been a really awesome experience. So thank you guys so much for your love and support. I'm so happy that a lot of you are feeling pumped up and motivated. We're kicking 2018 in the butt, you guys. Alex has been hibernating in the basement all night. I'm gonna go see what he's up to. I think he's recording a new song. Hey, how's your song coming? It's got a ways to go. Does it? Will you have how many more days? Three more days? Two. Two more days, sweet. Can't wait to hear it. Just wanna say goodnight. And now I just wanna say goodnight without the camera. <laughs> That's it for today's video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you loved it, share it with your friends. If you wanna be my workout buddy, don't forget to subscribe. We'll see you tomorrow.